Hey guys, welcome back to part two of my Doom 3 gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed the first one. This episode isn't going to be as long, it's... Squad leaders give sit rest. Over. God, your oxygen runs fast. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are gonna hear a bunch of random swears too. Like fuck me running backwards to the forest with a hedgehog. Uh that is also from the special features of the Doom movie. Starring The Rock. I'm gonna see if the shotgun's down here. See, you're supposed to fall. Like, you're supposed to walk on that back platform and it's supposed to uh, crumble. But, yeah, that shit didn't happen. So. All units, this is Command HQ. Report directly to Marine Headquarters and await further. There's nobody even chasing you, dude. I heard the radio. That's usually a, a good giveaway for it. My accuracy still sucks. Oh god, mother of god. How the hell did my accuracy get that bad? You always want to be looking around for those PDAs. Always. Oh, we don't get to meet that guy until a little bit. I'm not gonna go that way just yet. Anytime you guys are gonna get like a new weapon or something, uh, you're most likely gonna get like trapped or dropped or whatever. It's gonna try to startle you. Primarily because it's a new weapon. So what's up? Alright, uh, this way. How much time do I have? Sorry guys, one second. Oh, I still got a bit. Come the fuck at me, bro. You, sir, I'm gonna blow you up. Just like that. What's is down here? Uh, crouch. Flashlight. Gotta get that flashlight. Flashlight. Grenades! Oh, I thought that was grenades. I got excited. <laughs> gotta get that flashlight.
We're gonna meet my most favorite enemy right now. See that shit on the other side? Oh my god, go. <laughs> oh, mother of god. Mother of god. Mother of god. Look at that dodge. He just took a whole lot of lead to the crotch, wouldn't you die? I like in the uh, next one. I'm going to record this one and then I'm going to record the uh, Resurrection of Evil, so that way you guys get the full thing. Might as well, right? But, uh... I like... I do like the second one. The second one's actually pretty cool. You get a double barrel shotgun. Oh, we got Alright, so I was right. There was a guy. I was just looking the wrong way. Stop. I want to play a couple games at night so I actually get a good reaction, you know. Oh, I'm trying to make my way. Oh, no you fucking didn't. Told you. I said, game, he only got one down. The monorail track is destroyed. Unable to secure safe transportation back to base. Over. See, look at that shit. That shit actually made me jump. Oh, damn it. Yeah. I really can't say what I just did. Barracks access, airlock. Okay. Holy jeez. I looked down as soon as that happened. <laughs> Mother of God. What's up, buddy? You were at me, I ordered at you. Yeah. This is Sergeant Kelly. All yeah. Back to HQ and await further orders. Gotta save up that ammo. That goes way too fast. Yeah. I would do a mission like every time it loads, but then the levels or the uh, videos would be way too short. So I'm just setting 15 minute timer, and then. Whenever I find a good place to stop after that. All remaining Marine units, this is Sergeant Kelly. I am unable to reach Mars City from my current position. Move to Marine HQ to regroup and await further orders. Hey, you. Up here. Quick. You are a gentleman and a scholar, and I thank you. Oh, wait. Fuck yourself. Oh, don't be like that.
I want some goldfish, actually. I I was the only one still alive. You have a wrench. I found you. Something happened. I don't know what. It was like a shockwave. It passed through the entire base. It started changing. It was crazy. I, I was working up here on the vent shafts. I don't know how I survived. Go for help. Oh, you know exactly how you survived. You sick bastard. Careful. I don't know what's in there. How is he still talking to me? I'm quite a ways down this tunnel. <laughs> and he sounded like he was right fucking next to me. Hey. Thank you. Blood. Blip. Come at me, bro. Ha <laughs> Uh-oh. What's up, dude? I done got my keycard. Alright, and I got something. I'm going to check time. Two minutes left. Two minutes, 30 seconds, roughly. Manage you. This is Specialist Wilson. My team is gone. They're all dead. I'm running blind here. What are my orders? Over. Specialist Wilson. I'll be Sergeant Kelly. Stay sharp, son. Build your last note. Reload bad time. We'll find you. Let me see if the laptop. <laughs> I love that guy. Right there. He is amazing. Or she, depending on... Like, if you're, like, most people in America who name their cars after girls. <sighs> no piling up. Oh my gosh! Oh, oh my god. Alright, where are you at? Hey buddy. Sir, you're missing your head. Oh my god. Mother of God. Ugh. See, that's it. I should have talked about right there. <sighs> about always being locked and loaded. <sighs> that could have gone better. My timer's about to go off, so I'm going to end this clip as soon as I step my fat ass over here. Uh, la, 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 Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks for watching part two, guys. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah. I really don't have a whole lot to say other than thanks for watching. Like usual, the usual lovey-dovey stuff. Alright, I'm gonna open this one and then I'll end the episode. Uh, la 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 Oh, patient deck. Dr. Mark Casey at 1547 patient Jonathan Wills 
was admitted after complaining of insomnia and nausea. According to the nurse, Mr. Wills was calm and exhibited no signs of disorder when he was brought to exam room 5. However, by the time I reached him at 10 after 4, his personality had changed dramatically. Dramatically? In the room, Mr. Wills lunged at me with a scalpel he apparently stole from a supply drawer. With the assistance of an orderly, we managed to subdue and sedate him without injury. Mr. Wills was heavily medicated and could not be diagnosed, but in the 20 minutes he was left unattended, he managed to carve three symbols in his arm and cut his own tongue into two halves. I, I can only guess at the cause of his problems. I hope that additional psychiatrists arrive soon. In the meantime, in response to this assault, all medical supplies and armaments will be locked in a secure hospital cabinet with the code 347. Dr. Casey and out. Yeah, it's really medical supplies. The only medical supply is this. Everything else is bullets. Either way, again, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed part two. Um, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because, you know, that always helps me out. Especially when you subscribe. But, uh, yeah, either way, have a good day, guys. And don't forget that I love you.